hello my beautiful sweets welcome back to my channel sweet sadie j tv thank you guys so very very much for all the love and support you show, show my channel as per usual i have a dollar tree haul to share with you guys today and i'm calling it a wowza dollar tree haul because i was truly wowed okay First of all, I could not believe y'all seen on my community page and my shorts that I actually found. <sighs> breathe, breathe. The Sesame Street Wet and Wild um, makeup line. I believe I got everything in the collection except for the cosmetic bag, but I'm hopeful that I will find it. But anyway, without further ado, I don't want this video to be too long as per usual. So let's jump right into this. Okay, my sweets, y'all know I'm just a big kid and I don't really even celebrate 4th of July. I do celebrate Memorial Day. Well, I used to because Memorial Day was my mom's birthday. But now that she's gone, eh. But anywho, I digress. I, would, I couldn't help it. Anything that blinks or flashes or whatever, I just have to get. So I bought the Patriotic headband with the stars on it. And I just thought it was so cute. And I think I did test it before I bought it because it's very important. You There was a tab that you had to pull. So it lights up like that. But it has three different settings. You can do it that one. But my nails are probably going to get in the way. Let me see. What's the shortest nail I have? So, it has three different settings. <laughs> but it's hard to push that that little button. So, if you push it three different times, you'll get a different, a faster, a slower, or just a light stay on. So, I thought that was really, really cute. So, I did get it because I'm a big kid. And, of course, it comes with the warning tag. So, I got that. And then I bought the glasses to match. The patriotic glasses to match and they're fun <laughs> if I don't do anything but sit down on my patio and put my glasses in my band and my headband while the fireworks are going off but they look like this <clears throat> excuse me oh y'all I changed out my nose rings and I gotta get adjusted to them because I keep striking them but look <laughs> lady C likes stuff like this she wears glasses in most of her videos <laughs> She'll get a big kick out of these. And then you press it again. And then it's just just like the headband. I just thought they were cute for $1.25. How could you go wrong, right? So I got them. I was like, you know what? I got to have these. <laughs> I have to have them. So I got those. And then I just for my collection, I bought the Barbie um, Brush Buddies. This is the Sonic Barbie in Soft. With the battery, they all come with the batteries. I showed you guys these in a previous walkthrough. They had Hot Wheels, brush, um, what was it, Blippi, and different color Crayolas. And this is her right here. She's so cute. And that's the Barbie that comes on this one. I don't know if the, the Barbies are different on the back or anything, but this is just to go into my Barbie collection because y'all know... Everything but the little low-cut socks <laughs> that had Barbie on them, I'm buying. Because those little low-cut socks were just like, oh no, don't even bother. So I got that, okay. And now we're going to get into some of this other stuff that I have to put my specs on, y'all. I have been noticing here and there that in several um, stores that they have started restocking the hard candy. This is very, very, um, well... I haven't seen it in a long time. This is a hard candy color correct expert stick. It's in orange. It's, they say it's new, but we've had these before. It corrects dark circles and spots, medium to dark skin tones, and it's a 0 0.10 ounce, and it's hard candy color correct expert stick. And we've seen these before, but I have not seen them any hard candy in eons and I was surprised I found this right here at my own local Dollar Tree on Raleigh Road so I was like what <laughs> more hard candy because y'all know before I had to go, go all the way down to Emporia Virginia to find the hard candy that I showed you guys before 
And speaking of Emporia, Virginia, I did go back and get me another one of the lip gloss that I showed you in a previous haul. This is a Glossaholic um, holographic 3D lip gloss in the color Caramel Twist. And I love mine so much. I wear it almost every day, whether I have lipstick on or not. If I wear lipstick, I put this on top of the lipstick. If I don't wear any lipstick, I just wear this. And I love it. Love it, love it, love it. So, I was going to get several more to put into my giveaways coming up, but they only have one left. So, I grabbed that one. And then while I was there, I found this. And I think this is something Marina might like. My girl Marina from Confessions of a Dollar Tree Addict. I think this is too light for me. But, again, they come in these little black bags with no nothing on them. And I believe it is hard candy. I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah. This is Hard Candy Light Bright Whipped Brightening Concealer. Um, it is in the it's Hard Candy and it is in the color of do 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 oh tan. Oh, I don't know if that might be too dark for Marina. So maybe my older sister might like it, but this is what it looks like, and it's so beautiful. It is still sealed because I didn't want to open it because I thought I was gonna send it away to um to marina but we'll see she'll get back to me and let me know whether that's too light i thought it looked you know pretty good but my my older sister might be able to wear this and again it's just a whipped brightening concealer and i don't do concealers but you can see if you can see hard candy right there oops sorry it says hard candy so yeah I'll tell y'all, I've been, like, <clears throat> pleasantly surprised finding hard candy back in the Dollar Trees again. So, I picked up those items. And one more item, I picked up a toy because y'all know, like I already said, I'm just a big kid. Okay, but they have these new, I don't know if these are new or not, but the first time, they're new to me. The Sonic the Hedgehog, they're like the squeezins like we have with the potato heads and the piglets and the whatever it was pigs but this one is sonic the hedgehog which one will you get this is collect them all squeeze lens uh squeezy collecting characters and you can collect what is it one two three four five six so it looks like this on the front i already opened it y'all know i'm just a big old toy i mean a big old kid so <laughs> i was looking on the back to see which one i might want to get and in the store, I said, I thought I wanted her right there. But I believe I got her, which is fine because I don't mind. I'm always going for the girls and I wouldn't mind having the little fox or whatever he is. I forgot all these characters of Sonic the Hedgehog, but yeah. <laughs> I did get her. She's so cute. She looks like this. <laughs> I was like, oh, more to add to my toy collection. Um, so she might not fit in that little case, but she was cute. And as long as I got one of the girls, I was okay with it. So, okay, moving on to our next few items. Okay, my sweets. I showed you guys these socks the other day in a previous walkthrough while I was out in Zebulon. And I was so happy I took that drive out there that day, y'all. God is so mysterious in the way he does things because... I was literally on my way back to Wake Forest, and I realized I had just gone to Wake Forest and didn't find a whole lot. And right before I came to the turn on Capitol Boulevard on US-1 to go past my turn that I would go to to Zebulon, something, well, God, I'm going to say God just said, go to Zebulon. You know, you just went to Wake Forest. So, of course, when I got to my turn... I turned and went to Zebulon instead of going to Wake Forest. And that's how I scored big on the Sesame stuff. But in my mind, I'm just like, thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Because the way he works in mysterious ways, everything that happens to me that is good, God did it. That's my story. And I'm sticking to it. Okay. Moving right along with the socks. I found these. They're not. No show socks, they're kind of like ankle socks. They don't actually say it, but they have the logos on the socks that say that they are a Hershey's um, product. 
these are being so much more money in the regular stores than a dollar twenty-five, and they have this lime green, which I think is so cute. And I used to love me some Jolly Ranchers when I was a kid. I don't like them so much now. They just don't taste the same. So, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But this one says Jolly Rancher with the little uh, lime on it. And then this one is a nice little colorful one with the little um, candies on it. I thought they were really cute for gifts or donations. And this one, I didn't realize I picked up two Jolly Ranchers, y'all. But I did. So, this is more like... For a girl, I guess. This is the pink one. And this just says, da 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 da, um, Jolly Rancher, hard candy, watermelon. <laughs> and it's got the little watermelon face on it. And it's hard candy, watermelon. And then on this side, it says Jolly Rancher. Hmm. These are cute, y'all. But I was looking for um, my Dorito ones, and I haven't been able to find them yet. But this one just says the same thing, Jolly Rancher Hard Candy Blue Raspberry. So if you see it like that, Jolly Rancher Hard Candy Blue Raspberry. So I just thought they were cute. Like I said, if I don't wear them, which I probably won't, they'll be nice for gifts or for donations. And then I found the Bubble Yum one, but I'm missing a sock. I didn't notice it until I got it home. So if I see these again, and I've seen them several times since I picked these up and didn't realize it. Um, but yeah, if I see them again, I might grab another pack. But this one is the pink one with the unicorn on it, I think. It has, I think that's what it is. This is Bubble Yum, okay? It's hard to open these socks up. <laughs> well, it looks like a mean unicorn or a duck or something, I don't know. <laughs> but Bubble Yum, okay, in the pink one. I don't know what that is, y'all. Is that a horse or something? No, I see. Oh, I thought that was a unicorn. Okay. Anywho, and then I got this side, which is the missing one. And this looks like... Ugh, God, I can't get it open. Just says bubble yum, y'all. But it looks like this. And that's the one that's missing. And this also looks a lot shorter than these. So, I don't know what's up with that. But, anywho, that's what I got. Did notice I was missing one, so, and I, like I said, I've seen them several times since I was in Zebulon. But these two are my favorite. These two I might be keeping for myself. This is Hershey Kisses, two pair. Okay, Hershey Kisses, two pair. And they're so cute. That purple right there, the kisses. And I believe it says, yeah, just kisses on both sides. Okay, and then you have this one with the little candy, and it says kisses. So, I really like these two, and their size is um, 6 to 12. So, all of them are 6 to 12, if I didn't say that already. And then, of course, this one. Y'all know, my Reese's. <laughs> Again, Hershey's, okay. <clears throat> this one is the Reese's, and I love, love, love me some Reese's. And then this side is Hershey Kisses. So, yep, Hershey Kisses. So, I did pick those up while I was out in Zebulon. Because that was the first time I saw them. And then we're going to get into the last few items of this haul for today. Oh, coming right up. Okay, my sweets. What you saw in the thumbnail. These are so darn cute. Oh, my God. And as y'all know, this is coming, this, all this Sesame Street stuff is going to be in three different giveaways. So if you guys help me get to 10K, sharing my video, telling your friends, telling your relatives, and everyone to subscribe and check out Sweet Sadie J's um, YouTube channel, there will be three different gifts of all the Sesame items that I am able to find so far. I believe I'm only missing the cosmetic bag, but I've already gotten that taken care of because I've got um, my phone number with everybody, okay? So when they come in or they unload them off those um, new boats in the back, they're going to hold them for me. So anyway, this one is the limited edition Wet n Wild, no scram. <laughs> I love trash. These are makeup sponge and case set. This is the cutest thing I've ever, ever seen. So you've got, what's the name in the garbage can? 
And this is the case. The trash can is the case. And then it's got all the little stuff on the back. Okay. Sesame Street. Wow. <laughs> and I had to hunt these down. I did not find these um, at the Zebulon store. I had to hunt these down and I had to call around and they held them for me. So I got four of these. One for me and three for y'all. Okay. And the same thing, um, they had this, but they had to pull it out of the box for me at Zebulon because I had missed it. And then she's like, they're there, they're hanging. I'm like, no, they're not. I wouldn't have missed them. And she came over and she's like, oh, we didn't put them out yet. So she got me the Wet n Wild um, hand mirror. So freaking cute. Me want cookie. <laughs> Me one cookie and the mirror is on the back. Isn't that darling y'all? Dollar Tree trying to make us lose our minds because this is so awesome and I feel so so blessed because it's something that I thought I would never ever find. Okay. And this is one of my favorites. Well they're all, but these are what this is one of my favorites. These are the makeup brushes. Limited edition four piece makeup brush set. You get a yellow one, blue one, green one, and red one. So, Big Bird, um, Cookie Monster, Groucho, and I forgot his name, but y'all know, y'all know who it is. But aren't they darling? Look at these makeup brushes, y'all. Sesame Street limited edition, and there's all the characters. And I'm just like, oh my goodness. So, yeah, and they had so much of this stuff. They didn't just have a few items, y'all. They had a lot, okay? But, you know, my pocketbook, mm, okay? This one here is limited edition, three-piece, multi-stick set, wet and wild. And it has, <laughs> I'm trying to see, yay, Sesame Street. So, the packaging is just so cute. Three-piece, multi-stick set. Um, this delectable multi-stick set features three multifunctional makeup sticks in a velvety cream to powder formula that applies seamlessly to eyes, cheeks, and lips. Mix and match to create multiple delicious looks. So that's what these are for. Okay, so you got the three different colors. I think they're three. Yeah, because this is a lighter one, this is a darker one, and this is the blue one. And you can use them on multiple ways. So, it says, om nom nom. <laughs> so, when he's eating his cookies, he always goes, nom nom nom. <laughs> but the packaging is so cute. It's like reading a comic book on all the packaging. So, I love them. I got four of those. And then, of course, my absolute, absolute favorite, once I find that cosmetic bag, is, of course, the palette. This is the limited edition Wet n Wild 123 Sesame Street palette for eye and face. And it says, hello, hi, aw, yeah. <laughs> and it tells you, oh, I thought it told me the colors on the back, but it's all in yellow. And this is what the palette looks like. Isn't that cute? Can y'all see the little characters on the... On the colors, I might have to put my glasses on to see what colors these are because they have it in yellow. In yellow, I can't see that. I cannot see that. So, oh, crap, up the later. Let's see if I can see it with my glasses on. It says, no, I can't really see it with my glasses on. But you guys, when you see it in person, you'll see the colors. So, I'm not even gonna sit here and try to strain it. But this. This was what I really wanted out of everything. Of course, once I found it, I couldn't help myself for grabbing everything else. Okay, this and the brushes. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Of course, I don't use um, curl eyelash curling curlers, but I wanted it because it was just so cute. It's actually got a Cookie Monster like keychain on the bottom of it, if you could see it, and it says Wet and Wild Cowabunga. So it looks like this. This is the Wet n Wild eyelash curler, and I did not use these, but I just got it for that. Y'all see the little keychain? Can you see the thing in there? 
It's got a little cookie monster eating his cookie in there. And I'm just like, uh-uh, I want that. <laughs> I want it. I want it. It's so cute. Eyelash curler. Yeah, that's all it says. And then, like, all the rest of them, it's got all the little comic book um, little logos on it. So I got that. Now, these are small, and I'm not probably not going to be able to tell you guys what these say, but... This is Wet n Wild Zippity Zap Limited Edition. This is, uh, looks like glitter to me, you guys. And I was having such a hard problem. Unleash your fairy spirit with a super concentrated, hyper-reflected, uh, reflective glitter gel. It's glitter gel for face and body. Comes in a unique blend of high coverage glitter that dries quickly and provides an intense and lasting multi-dimensional magical sparkle. Whew. Man, that was hard. <laughs> so that's what I this one looks like. And if you can see all the little, I call them um, glitter, fairy dust, whatever. But she's called Zippity Zap. And I thought it was so cute. Sesame Street. So we got that one. And then we have this item right here. It says, Save the Day Wet n Wild Lip Mask. And it's all of these are limited editions. And this one says, uh-oh, mineral. That just tells you the, um, the ingredients. This is not telling you what, what it, it just says is a lip mask. But it's just telling you the, um, the ingredients. So it's not really telling you how to use it. So, yeah, it says it's vegan, y'all. So, if you like vegan products, this looks like this. And it says, save the day. hope you guys can see that. And there's the color of it right there. And I just thought it was so cute. So, I got that one. And then this one is, um, L is for lipstick. This is a simple one. And it's so pretty. Marina would love this. It's not red, red, but it's it's a color that she loves to wear. And this is just called Be Kind. Oh, how cute. It's called Ellis for Lipstick. Ellis for Lipstick. And it's called Be Kind. I don't know if you guys can see that. Where it says Be Kind. Oh, come on. Camera focus. That is so cute. And that's what it looks like. Isn't that cute? Wow. So that's the lipstick. And then you got this one that says Happy to Be Me lip gloss. And I immediately grabbed this. This was so cute. And this is called Fun Size. So it looks like this. And they all had little hangers. So they had them all hanging up, you know, except for like the brushes. But they had the palettes hanging up. They had everything hanging up. So this is a cute little um, lip gloss by Wet n Wild. And I think if I can wear the flowers one, I could probably wear this one too. So we'll try it. We'll see what happens. Whew. And the last item in this collection so far is the Tickle Me Wet n Wild Lip Tingling Gloss. Now, I will not be wearing this because <laughs> I hate when they do that tingling stuff. But this one is called... Um, La 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 la. Oh, it doesn't have a name. Just made in Mexico. Let me see. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Wet and Wild. No, they didn't name this one. So this is just a Tickle Me um, Lip Tingling Gloss. It looks like this. <laughs> and he is so cute. But I don't really care for anything that makes my lips tingle. Or anything but if it was part of that collection I was getting it whether I will wear it or not Whew, Lord y'all but that is it that's 10 minutes oh my god this video is gonna be so long oh my god I'm sorry you guys <laughs> that this video is so long but that is it for today my sweets love peace and happiness sweet Sadie J coming back at you don't forget to be kind to each other the world is big enough for us all and please, please, please like, comment, and share my video if you like to. And everyone, have a blessed day. Bye, guys.